Hello guys, welcome to episode um, 7. Right, today we are, um, well, the last episode was a bit of a mismatch, uh, sorry for that. So I've decided i um, going to make, make a move kind of thing. Uh, I did think about moving over, over that way. Um, by the village and stuff and then I thought well you know done all the work here so what I kind of decided to do is to keep all this area in the middle as um, sort of farming farmland I think I'm gonna probably build it up another level so it's too deep and then off of each side I'm gonna build platforms um, so this is just a makeshift up one here for now this is black granite bricks I've ran out I need to cook some more up when I've got um oh the what's it called set up again great tech uh, bronze stuff set up again I think I've worked out why um we weren't getting anything <laughs> any steam out of this boiler because it seems to have an outlet on the side of it I noticed in an earlier video so obviously we need to come out the side of it with our pipe work so we're going to move over here, but I thought I'd make a new wrench. Um, obviously we need this one for crafting, but I've got a kind of um, Omni wrench mod. Uh, so that takes three iron ingots and an emerald. And we've got a few emeralds somewhere, I think. And so Libyine. Oh, we've got one emerald. Well, let's use it on something useful. Uh, three iron ingots so we'll make that put that in there and we've got it so I don't know I'm pretty sure so I'm gonna move all of this all of all of uh, bronze blast furnace can I that won't seem to uh, click and pick that up that will though I don't know whether can we use that, that'll probably break. No. Right. So I'm gonna take this apart. I'm gonna take all this apart and stuff. And move it over there. Right, we're doing pretty well. We've got some steel, so we'll get that shifted. Should I leave that there for now? Because uh, we've got power converters. So what I'm thinking is we could use some force craft engines to get ourselves some EU. Um, where are they? I'm not sure how much they are to build. Um, at power, uh, here we go. So first thing you need is the energy bridge. I think this might need a diamond. So that's one diamond. So then um, universal charger so we could go from a build craft consumer which only takes gold and a sterling engine which is cobble stone piston that's going to be easy enough um, and then we want um, low voltage producer I presume is what we're going to need so that's a consumer which is more gold uh, tin and rubber we got and a coil which we need to make that with the snips don't we and iron copper plate so we make that with iron plates and that is all we can make all of that we've got Billcraft engine over there um, I am gonna make Ender pearls left. Yeah, we've got some ender pearls. Three bits of string. I'm gonna need more string actually. So I'll have to go. Oh, we've got four bits of string. Let's see if I can remember how to make this because we're gonna need some animals here. Uh, trying to get them across the water with wheat, I think, is gonna be a bit of a pain. Gold. Um, oh. 
ender pearl string I think it's something like this what's that? it's a knot hmm knot gate maybe not maybe not Glass. Oh, it's nuggets. Well, a bit cheaper than what we thought then. Don't think I've done any gold nuggets yet. So, right, we'll make one of those. So I've see I've done on camera now. Um, I think yeah. I don't know whether to shift this up. But yeah. Um, if we're going to go for power, there's not much point in rebuilding that at the moment. We can rebuild that in our kind of technical museum when we get that up and going. Um, Let's have another quick look. So we'd need that. So we'd have EU. So what we would need with EU is a bat box, wouldn't we? Bat box. Batteries. So that's all makeable. Um, I think one of the first things we're going to need is going to be a furnace. So, electric furnace, why don't I have for that? Is that because I'm missing a plug-in? What else is there? There's a mass. Macerator. Yeah, I don't have that for the macerator do either, do I? So I think I must be missing so I'm going to have to look up on the wiki, get the, um, I'll see if there's an updated plugin um, to get that. I think I may have loaded the plugin on my side. I don't know whether you need the plugin on the server side. Right, so yeah, I think we'll get on. I think we can do most of that. We've got so much... Um, <coughs> We've got plenty of copper, we've got plenty of iron, and we've got plenty of tin. And at the moment, we've got a fair amount of steel. 20, 84. I'm not sure what we use that one for. 84 steel. So I think I will set this up because we might need the steam furnace going up over there and um, yeah right yeah so I'll I'll get and get that stuff ready so I'll make um, some engines we'll get some pipe work um, I'll make the build craft consumers and stuff and um, then we will um, move it up there and see if we can get into the electrical age. So I'll see you guys in a sec. Hello guys, right. Um, forget all that, because I'm pretty sure in the last episode what I wanted to do and was quite looking forward to doing is taking a look at the thumb crafts, because I haven't done that and I wanted to do it on camera rather than off camera. I don't even know if I got the wand. I may have lost that because I have died. Unless I pull it, oh, I might put it in the box over there. In the box, in the chest. I built some tables, didn't I? So, yes, yes, we got it all there. That's okay, right. So, um, 
Oh, it was ink. It was a feather. That was what it was I needed. It was a feather. So we'll probably end up making somewhere for this to go. Um, so what I needed was ink, wasn't it? A glass vial and a feather. Do I have feather somewhere? I've picked up my villager with a golden lasso. And um, we've got a couple of cows now. And I've um, set out just farm areas for now, a bit like vanilla farms really. Got wheat over there and potatoes there. Uh, we don't have any trees up and going at the moment. Right, where did I put... The feather, because I definitely came back. I'm sure I came back with a feather. Please tell me I got one somewhere, otherwise I'm going to have to go... I'm going to keep running about again. Got to get all the chests in order. That's bees. There was another chest around here somewhere with another stuff in it. Ah, oh, God, I haven't got a feather. Let me go make the glass vial, if I can remember. I'll make a glass bottle. Got some glass somewhere. So, scribing. Glass bottle. Don't want to know, I just want to know how to craft it. Right. Glass bottle. Okay. Okay, well, that. let's pop you back in there. And then... Right. Boat. There you are. This is the only problem with living on the island. We need to get two of everything. The Noah's Ark going on, and uh, we'll be okay then. Let's see if we can find a chicken over here. I just want to kill one and pick one up, I think. We can get on with... Um, this one. Come here, you. Right, we've got... Where did that feather go? I've seen a feather come off of it. It's just a bit like those blaze powder things where I'm getting stuff disappearing the grain for some reason. I definitely seen a feather come off of that. Cone. Well, let's try find another chicken and kill him and see if we've got a bit of a problem going on here. I'm sure I had a feather on me earlier. Are they turning into something? What is that? I know I had a feather, so whether this is just Greg Tech or some mod I've got on here making stuff harder. Right, I'm gonna go running around finding more chickens and then I'll um I'll be back. Alright guys, I finally got feathers, but certainly don't drop off of every chicken. It's um more like one in four. I picked a chicken up. 
So We're going to pop that somewhere safe over wherever I put my chicken pen. No. I'm going to put the chicken pen, we'll pop him in there. I got some eggs, so it would be nice if we get another chicken out of this. Oh, yes, look at that. <laughs> Love it. Right. Okay, so we've got seven, killed nine chickens, but every chicken I killed I got two feathers off of it so um, right let's make one of these scribing tool things then have I got a lot of water in that yeah okay we're gonna need to put a water supply in anyway aren't we for um Whatever side I'm gonna do it over there, I think we'll make a something to do with thumbcraft. Right, um, water bottle, thing, feather. Shapeless crafting. That's an empty one. <laughs> right. I know Direwolf said you've got to put these on the left. I'd rather have it on the right. Can you put it on the right? You can put it wherever you want. Nice, we're getting somewhere. Okay. Yeah, not sure. Right, I have watched a few things. I think you've got... You can mix these things up a bit, can't you? And do... A, oh, we gained one. Which one did we gain? Lotus, was it? Auto in air. Nice. Right, okay. Um, I want to make that thing that you're looking. So, let's put that in there and that, that and that. And let's take our thumb and nonicon. Oh, I think we've got, a, we've got a zap something. We've got a zap something with a wand? Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, is that what we've got in it? Ah, so we need to go out and find some of the node things. Right. Okay. So. So we want... What is it I want? Through the looking glass thing. Can I... Where are you? Is that it? How do I read it? Basic information. Basic. Can't remember. Read the book. How do I read the book? Ah, crucible. Right, that's how I read the book. It's coming back now. So what I need to do is, I'm sure I got that up earlier. What's that? Need the. Basic. Information. Research. This is what we want. And that workbench. Thermometer. Or thermometer, as not people seem to call it when I would say it's a thermometer. But I don't know. Thermometer is something that. Gold, glass. Um, can we put any shards or do we need the different shards? That's glass and gold. Alright. To bring some more stuff about. Gold. Two gold. Piece of 
Raz. Um, so what's the most... So we've got loads of those ones. So let's... Can we make that by putting all of that type around? No, it doesn't seem to be able to. Have we got to put the wand in there? Do we have to do anything? No, so we're going to have to do it like the book said. So that's an air, an earth, an entropy. That's an earth. That's an entropy, and we've got lots of air on there, so we we'll put you back. So it's that one down there, and that one up there. Shift click you out there, right. Okay. And then we need a water, a fire, and an order. So we've got a water, a fire, you back and an order. Okay, we've got the stuff to make it. That's good. Water, fire, order. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Ha <laughs> ha. Grass block. You do not have the knowledge required to understand this. Can you? No. You've got to throw things on the floor, haven't you? Q. Coalstone wall. Ooh, got something. Two research points for Saxon. Gain one research point for Pariti. Peretitio. To a flower. No. Keeps going into the engine. What about this crystal thing? Oh, three research points for Saxon. Two. Saxon and stuff, so we're going to be running around doing everything, aren't we? Torch. Ooh, Lux. Don't have enough knowledge for that one. Crops. Nope. Is that just classed as crops? No. No, no, no. Do we get something for farmland? Two for Saxon. Try this. Uh, nah. Nah. Let's take a B out. Try the B. Don't have enough to understand you. Start land, so you're not doing a lot. It's still okay. No. No manager. Uh, we just go into him. Chicken. No. We do grass. Don't have enough for grass. So we're gonna have to go off and try and find some stuff. Or stand around and keep throwing. Ooh. Fell through a hole. Just to come and do water. Oh, yes. Nice. Okay. Um, let's try stone rather than cobble. 
Saxon is all we get for that. What about this stuff? Nothing can be learned. Nothing can be learned. Bad. No man. Oh, I see. So once you've learnt it, it comes up with what it is. So is that the same when you shift click on things now? Ah, yes. Ah, cool. Okay. Start to understand it. Starting to understand it a little bit. Try a furnace. So how do you do the furnace without stand a bit oh yeah, right, nice. So if we stand a bit further away from things. Don't necessarily end up clicking into it. Ah. Italian. Ten research points I got from Italian. Try the research table. Don't have a knowledge for that one. Can learn nothing from that one. So I need to try and go off and find one of these node things, don't I, to get some stuff for the wand. Fill a wand up. Right, okay, well I think that will be enough of that for today. And I think we'll go and do a bit of um, research or whatever on our dark craft table. So let's make ourselves, um, let's get some iron. We want force. Uh, we want some of that. Some sticks. And what we'll do, I think, is we'll make ourselves some force tools. Why can't we make force pickaxe? Oh, we need four sticks. Dummy. <laughs> See what we can make. We've got a pickaxe. We've got a shovel. Um, can you make armor? Can <coughs> I do a good armor? False tunic. I'm sure we could probably enchant that then, couldn't we? So I don't think I've got any armor. I've lost my little thingamajig out in the middle. If you notice, my the character's gone. Okay, let's uh, get some boots. Um, 
that. Cool. And some leggings. It's a kilt. <laughs> so that, on the whole, even not enchanted, is pretty good armour. Right. So let's, how can we click on this and let's get our armour off. So I wonder if we can get feather falling in. Stuff like that. Force boots. Force infuser can be used to view your force tools for special upgrades. That ranged from vanilla fortune to auto grinding or even wacky side effects. So is there anything in this book? It's a book episode. No, we can't read it. Okay, so it looks like I see the land, but where exactly are the tracks? Who knows, mate? Who knows? Healing seems to have the opposite effect on undead creatures. Force bows now have toggleball modes. Change modes. Area mode that can be toggled by right clicking with the tool in your hand. This may be slower but sure breaks a lot of blocks. Material show up great material show there. Upgrade in the GUI as secondary tool tips. Oh okay, right. <coughs> Um, <coughs> right, gotta go. Hello guys, <coughs> I'm back. Right, um, all my uh, reeds have disappeared, so I had to go out and find some more. Um, I don't know, I think it was because I put an extra line of dirt uh, along the edge, and they must have all popped up and despawned. The boat's floating away out there. Right, so I've made a couple more items here. Um, so we got a force. Should we do the force pickaxe? Force pickaxe. Now, I think we put sugar or something. Maybe not. Where does it go? Or can we just put that in the middle? Can't remember how you do this name. Go. Question mark. Known upgrades. Don't already have done, so you should make a book of Medora. As it contains the sum of all dark craft knowledge. Simple force. Transmute. A book sh simply force transmute a bookshelf and you'll be on your way to mastering dart craft. Don't have bookshelves, I chopped them all up. Two books. Where did I put all the other books over here, I think? Three books. So how do we transmute a bookshelf then. Uh, just by throwing it down. Achievements seem to have uh, get the wand. Force rod. Let's try and use this one up because you can't join them together. Oh there we go. Nice. Okay. We have a book. Alright. So we've done the force infuser. Got the force rod. We got the upgrade. Experience teams. The vanilla book can be upgraded in the force infuser with experience upgrade to turn them into experience teams. 
these tomes are capable of storing an infinite amount of experience. Shift right clicking and holding an experience tome will draw experience from you and store it in the tome, while right clicking will retrieve stored experience. Well that's quite cool. Um, I wonder how is it you made one? Upgrade in a book. So I wonder if you die. Oh, I've stuck a open blocks mod on here. So I think if I die now, I get a grave. And then if I knock the grave up, I get a ghost. And if I kill the ghost, I get my stuff back. So let's pop that in there. And what do we have to upgrade it with? Can't remember a name. Experience upgrade. Upgrade in the force infuser with experience. Upgrade to turn them into experience tomes. Oh, with the experience upgrade. How do we get the experience upgrade? Craft and force gems. Mobs might drop them. They don't very often. Storage units. I'll have to have a read up of this when I. Um, force belts, force packs. Force cards. Right. Armour can be crafted out of force ingots and it provides about as much protection as iron armour. Though each piece of force armour reduces all income and damage by an additional 8%. On top of this, force armour is upgradable in the force infuser with several upgrades that will enhance its protective abilities and the wearer's mobility. Force armour will enhance the speed with which blocks are broken when using tools by certain percentage simply by having more pieces equipped. With at least three pieces equipped players will also be able to punch most blocks with empty hands to harvest them. With some restrictions players will also be able to force punch entities. To do so some relatively acceptable damage with empty hands. Valid upgrades for the Force Armour are Charge, Charge 2, Camo, Speed, Wing, Heat and Sturdy. Damage. 100% gas speed with longer jumping on it, piece of wing. Increase the base movement. With four upgraded pieces equipped, the speed upgrade will also slightly enhance. Heat upgrade will reduce fire damage taken. Damage will increase the amount of damage your force punches do. Camo will make force armor appear invisible, giving the illusion of no armor for one's vanity. Charge upgrade will give force armor the ability to be charged with IC2. When charged armor is discharged, its abilities and protection. But that's all fair enough. But what are the items that you can put in? Okay. Force bricks. Well, I know. Ooh. Force panels. Power tools. Okay, let's. Uh, I'm gonna have to have a look through that. But let's try and put. I think we can put. Um, should we try and put speed or something on our boots? 
because speed is sugar. So let's put that on there. Don't seem to have any of these open to put stuff in, do I? Am I being stupid here? So that's going to give us more liquid force. We've got power. And these are supposed to light up, aren't they? So I reckon we've got two lit up there. Maybe. So why can I not put let's put anything on anything? Right, and then the claws of damage. <coughs> so let's get that. Let's get that. Oh, we're gonna have to Am I putting them in the wrong slot. It won't go in there. It won't go anywhere. No, it's not happening. It's not happening. Why is this not happening? Well, I've got to try and upgrade this thing. So that's gone in there. Force shovel. Can't put sugar on that. Alright guys, I'll pause this and come back. Hello guys. Alright, well. Um, I was just watched a bit of a video, but for some reason, yeah, so what I did was I shift click the sword, which went into there, so let's see if we can put that in. See, now I can't put that in there, but then if I shift click, it goes in. Um, and I did see the bloke the owner of it, or whatever, the author of it, he put in um, got some force nuggets. I captured a, uh, I captured the beekeeper, and he's, um, I got him trapped just over behind here, which is why I keep hearing the villager noise. And I had to put one of those mufflers or something in, in there. Right, so let's try shift clicking and seeing where that goes. So that's gone into there. Let's see what we get. Oh, and this thing will upgrade by putting these force rods in here. So they don't tell us what we got there. So we've got knockback and sharpness. And knockback can be a bit of a pain. That must have been the, uh, what's it called? So can I pop another one in there. No, it won't let me. Okay. So let's try our pickaxe. Let's put that in there. Doesn't tell us whether this thing's going up any percentage or not, does it? Um, so I think we can put force logs or something on that. Can we put speed on it as well? Yeah, looks good. Drink a nice cup of coffee. It's quite cold here today. So we've got lumberjack and we've got speed one. I presume lumberjack is a bit like the tree capitator thing. Um, so let's try the boots again see if we can get speed on our boots and if that does anything. Um, maybe a nugget, does that do anything? 
So what will a nugget do? Want feather falling or something like that, really, don't we? Not much point if that's going to put knot back on it. Not much point in having knot back, is there? Damage. I wonder if you can put other things on once you've done it. Well, let's try putting two of those on it. Is that one lit up now as well? Speed. Right, so let's see. Right, okay. Backwards and forwards. I think that's a little bit quicker. It's not a massive amount quicker, is it? And if we can go up, nah. Still can't beat the boots of the traveller. Right, I think we should just probably mess about with our tools for a bit. Um, oh, we're tier two. We've gone up. What can we do with tier two? Now, once we've done it, we've done it, haven't we? We can put three things on now, though. Um, let's try, because I think you can put heat or something, which is fire protection. Oh, I've got two blaze powders, though. Yeah, I'm going to keep those until we can find a, a thing. Are we going any faster when we run, are we? That seems to be pretty quick, that, actually. Let's try our lumberjack. Whoa! That is... I was taking loads of them out. Ho 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 ho! That is pretty cool, I like it, that. Can't get in there, though. You're taking it all out, or is there some left? Tonight, let's try and get this one. Yes. That made pretty light work of that, that's for sure. Cool. So can we put, should we put, uh, what was, that was sugar, wasn't it? So, so we, I think we might be able to put fortune on this. So we have to make fortune cookies. I think. Which is paper and a cookie. And a cookie's too weak. Oh, I've got no cocoa beans. I haven't got a cocoa recipe. I have to go off and find a jungle. So. Let's maybe try and put something I don't know what to put on. Um Don't know, don't know. Let's have, have a look. Let's put um Let's put speed on the shovel. If we got any more, we could put three speed on the shovel, and it would really uh, go for it, wouldn't it? 
because we're going to want some sand definitely to make some glass. Oh, I wonder what. Um, I wonder what. Oh, the one to make it last longer is. Durability kind of thing. What's it look like? What's going on? Oh, sparkly. Speed 3. <laughs> Let's go over there. Should have put speed 3 on the boots. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. That's very quick. Cool. Fall in a hole. Right. Cool. I'm going to have a look at. I'll have to look at the rest of the uh, the video to find out what some of the other ones are. You got any more of these force? Sort out some of them force rods lying about. Let's try me four shears again while we're on camera. Let's try doing a chicken. Oh my god. A lower stone guardian. Did I get the feather there? Yeah, so you can't cheer. <laughs> Anything with these. Can't pick up the feather, that's sorry the uh So I wonder what's doing that then. This is obviously a new thing because you can't sh no point in me shearing cows. What am I gonna get from here? Let's see how good my sword is. Attack damage seven, so that should take him out in one go. I didn't get anything from them. Can't get out now. Oh well. Right. There we go. So we're keeping our cows and we'll just be slaughtering them by hand when they're looting or something. Alright guys, well I think that'll do for today. And um, I'll have a read up. And we'll get... Um, can't pick anything up, can I? Too much junk on me. Yeah, we'll get um get a bit more knowledgeable on the dark craft stuff and we'll do some next episode. And hopefully we'll do uh, we'll get some machines made up as well, I think. Okay, right guys, well thanks for watching and I'll see you next episode.